Hi. Uh, please introduce yourself. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, my name is Martin Ting. I'm the founder of Seven Star Lake, and the Seven Star Lake is company focus on the rocket mission, the computers. So it's a, we uh, design um, and manufacture all the rocket eyes of the computer based on the military application and autonomous vehicle. Basically, it was a customer need a, a heavy duty, a high compression power, or the high performance, they come with us. Yeah. And what are we looking at here? What is this stuff? Okay, and the, the, for the Embedded War 2023, as we know, it's very important. Uh, the largest uh, embedded uh, uh, trade show in the in the, in the world, and we demonstrate uh, how we make those um, PCI wonderful rocket dice, the military the, the mountable. Like it means uh, those mountable, they can sustain the more than the uh, um, the hundred G about the shock and also the vibration. And uh, those products are very good for autonomous driving and also for you know kind of uh, different kind of heavy duty vehicles. When you say military, it's military spec, right? So yes. that means drop it's, it's, it's uh, water. Like, uh, yeah, like for military, it means uh, the product what we design, so we can certify from the temperature range minus 40 degrees, put up either up to 70 degrees without any fan. And even they can do, you know, IP65 for waterproof. As you can see, uh, many different kind of the military vehicles or the ships, they are in a very harsh environment. So basically, we can all design those products. So for example, you see like uh, this one is a 19 inch half, the recommend chassis is a highly the CPU, GPU stuff, and then they can easily put it in the, the transit recommend. So they're in a battlefield and any ground vehicle, they can easily take a carry this one. And also everything is based on the combustion cool. So you will see it's a no any moving parts inside the system. And they can ensure the complete system can survive in the, in the high vibration and shock. And even so you say middle standard, yeah, middle standard uh, thermal middle standard. shock vibration? Yes, yeah, certified and also including the EMI and EMC certified. So these two are the key about the whole Seven Star Lakes product range. What's this uh, NVIDIA Caradro? Intel Tiger Lake. Yeah, okay. Good, That's what you good. Have okay. You know the Intel is the global leading semiconductor leaders and the Intel can support a very, very um, high quality, high performance CPU. So we are using based on the Intel Tiger Lake H can up to the about eight a physical cores and the sixty threads. And NVIDIA GPU is one of the best uh, artificial intelligence about the, the processors. They can deal with the a lot of huge image and also keep the good performance. So the, in the ground vehicles, as you know, is a need to deal with a lot of the sensors visions and the fusion. So they need to, so these uh, GPU, CPU servers is perfect to deal in the, uh, um, the, the battlefield. We, we see a truck here. Yeah. What the truck is gonna do with this? Okay, uh, as you know, autonomous driving will be the future to help uh, the human beings to have a uh, more the safety the, the mobilities. As you know, from the level three to level four, level five, the challenging is like about, they need always have a high performance computing nodes. And it's a civil style, like, it's very good to design with a multiple CPU, GPUs. So it is not a, uh, the trunk could be the, the first uh, the vehicle and the highly adapt autonomous uh, technology. So that's why uh, we, we provide uh, the Seven Star Lake uh, GPU, CPU servers and uh, with the dual Xeon scalable processor and uh, with NVIDIA GPUs in all different kind of level five autonomous uh, driving the truck. Nice. Uh, is it already working or is it just a work in progress? No, 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 we already, actually um, the Seven Star Lake start to provide uh, um, the GPU computers from the global leading autonomous vehicle companies, including the, the US, the Google, and the GM, and the Volvo, and also in a, a majority of the European the, uh, vehicle makers. Yeah, right. So it's already uh, done in using the Seven Star Lake GPU computer in the vehicle since 2014 okay. until 2022. And then also I would like to introduce about this is our the partner, the Ampere. As you know, the Intel processor is good. They get up to 16 core, 40 core. But for uh, uh, Ampere is based on the ARM architecture. There's a very, very low power consumption, but with a huge uh, the computing cores. And uh, with, uh, so we partnered with, uh, with Ampere to launch about the three types of the top edge AI computers. One for 
kind of about the railway running stock, and another one for the autom autonomous driving, and another one is for heavy duty the military, the, uh, the, the vehicles. So how do you design these? Are they very special integration? Yes. Like nobody else do it yes. like, okay. like this? For example, the Ampere is one of the, uh, the most in, in, important the data center, the semiconductor provider. So Semistar like a partner with Ampere to use his processor, but we ruggedize with the complete system to meet the rolling stock standard EM5155. As we know, nowadays, all the rolling stock, they need to deal with the the hundreds about the cameras, and with those hundreds of cameras, how you can recording over the the image and those videos, and with in uh, anti vibration and shark system. So seven star like customized with Ampere, the 64 up to 128 core processes in the rugged disk uh, server. Nice. Is and this mass production or just prototype? It's a mass production. It's already mass production. And uh, besides of those kind of the um, high core com. The, with the with the Ampere so the processor, we can support up to you know the older flash, like okay, up to the 80 terabyte with one computer. So it means you see this is a top three edge computer. They are not only can supporting the high computing power, they also can support the very very large capacity of the storage. So it means the inside user, there. yeah, inside. So we can have an inside hard disk. Yeah, the whole flash. Or SSD. Flash. Yeah, the NVMe. So we support very high speed NVMe, support read and write. So for example, they can deal with the, the hundreds about the cameras and the recording, put all the data and for a rolling stock, uh, the, the operator, one week, no need to swap the, all of the, the, the SSD. So where is it going to go? Is so, it going to go in the so, okay, and van? The, or okay, car, because, special yeah, also, car, yes. bus? And uh, so it's, except to the rolling stock, those computers also can be doing see this um, artificial intelligence, the labeling and the object tracking uh, with the Ampere the processor and with the pre-built in the algorithm. It for the object detection, they can they can do a very, very, very high efficiency and they can detect all of the objects and to help the smart city to provide a, a, a more stable environment. Stable environment. Yes, yeah, stable environment. And for example, as we know, in the coming future, yeah. all the vehicles will be electrical bus, and the electrical bus, they will integrate with the, the cameras. So for, so for those, the high performance, the edge AI computer, the building with MP processor, with AI algorithm, they can easily can help the, the transportation operator to do a kind of the heat map, and to understand where have the traffic jam, and how they can improve the the public safety, we also have the can monitoring about the pedestrian behavior, something like that, it's extra. And it's not going to use all the battery on the bus. Um, it's power efficient. It's power efficient, for example, uh, for this um, uh, Ampere's uh, uh, 80 core, 64 core, it's very, very low power compared to other uh, semiconductor manufacturer. It's only about 30% about the power consumption. So it means it's a very um, longevity and it's sustainable for the whole environment. And when you, on the wall there, you, you show trucks. Yes. Uh, and buses. Yes. And vans. And they all connect. And they, what do they do? Okay, what's the mean? Okay, like uh, with MPS infrastructure, we know uh, no matter which kind of the vehicles, if they can integrate with the um, MPS, uh, the top edge AI computer, and then we talk about we can collect all the data, okay, from the smart cities, and we digest the data, do the labeling, object tracking, and we transmit the data to the cloud. So it means uh, we can help us, a city government uh, to build a digital infrastructure. So it means that all kind of the, the vehicle is a, is a mobile the sensors. So they can collect the data, just digest the data, and the transfer data to the backend system. It means uh, from the edge to the cloud, it's a completely uh, the infrastructure can help a city to build a safer uh, transportation and uh, a better world. For human beings. Are you talking to some cities? Talking some yes, countries? Yes, you know the our the solution seven star like the smart city solutions has been deployed in the city in the Taipei and in Kaohsiung, and for those cities can can help the um, the transportation environment to decrease about the is the the car accident in the intersections 
with those solutions, like we pro we can provide uh, uh, real time dynamic data. The data were including the, the the traffic jam and also the traffic. Uh, when I think of the future, people talk about self-driving cars will be so much safer. But before we have every car be self-driving, maybe you'll have the buses help all these cars that are not self-driving be more safe. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. That, that's very good. That's very good, the, the, the agenda. As you know, the autonomous driving maybe cannot be 100% um, be adapted in the coming five years. However, if we can uh, adapt this autonomous uh, driving technology, for example, level three, if we can use those level three technology and with Ampere as the processor and with seven star like algorithm, I believe the lowest bus, they can do a lot of a very good smart traffic management. So with those uh, smart uh, traffic management, uh, the solutions we can help the city to monitor all of the, tra the traffic uh, transportation status and uh, we can predict where is the uh, construction the area and how we can uh, improve the traffic situation based on the real time the data the capture and keep everybody safe yes, hopefully we'll keep everybody safe and uh, lower the, the car accident nice and over there yes uh, what do you show is this okay. so your products besides a lot we're talking about a lot of you know the heavy duty the panel computer and uh, this is a uh, the, the, the three UVPX, and the, this is you know the airborne computer, and uh, this is uh, um, in the in the ground vehicle, and you see the lowest uh, ruggedized computer. Like uh, we do a lot of um, uh, with uh, our the military customers, as you know the military uh, the vehicle they need a very ruggedized and they're high reliable. So with the seven star like uh, the the Intel, the base about the solution, and uh, everything is uh, fully certified by military. The standard A10 and also EMI EMC 461, the fully certified. Cool. So it's a good embedded world for you? Yes, you know, embedded, uh, 2020 embedded world is the most important and the most success successful. The computers, the show in the market, and the Seven Star Lake is participate in this show and with our partner, and we believe uh, it's a very important show for our people. Are you also in a Computex? Yes, we will be in the Computex. And are you coming to Computex? Uh, yeah, I hope so. You know, yeah, we for will, sure. We will also have the our own forum, and also we have the, the dinner party to launch your product. So we hope we can invite you, become our guest. In what Taipei. is the history of Seven Star Lake? Okay, Seven Star Lake's company, uh, we established in 2010, and we started to design and manufacture. The rocket. We uh, started to design the rocket dice. The stackable, you see, this is a, a, a very a special connector, and uh, what we can do, like uh, the, the rocket stackable, and they can keep the product highly reliable and anti vibration and shock with uh, this uh, very ruggedized messaging type of connector. Okay, so we start to do uh, this kind of uh, the, the CPU module, and then we are also making our own the special DC DC power converter to sustain the, all the, the, uh, the harsh environment. And then the company now, we have uh, the two part, the hardware, we're doing the military uh, heavy ruggedized GPU computer and also the cooling server. In the software part, we do the, OI, the AI smart traffic management solutions. Is it a big team? Uh, yes, uh, the Everybody in Taiwan? Yes, uh, we are all based on the, in Taiwan. It's around about uh, uh, the, the 40 people. So we are very focused on the hardware and the software. Cool. All right. Thanks Thank a lot. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So.